I'm with you on that. I have more toilet paper. How are you doing? Morning. We are going through significant boom here in Western Australia, a massive shortage of labor. I'm currently in the last stages of joining the police, but I feel like I'm missing on a fi financial golden carrot. Is there any tips? Uh, a bit vague, I know. Uh, look, here's one thing I can let you guys know as well, right? If you're only relying on your income, I don't care what that income is, to see you and your family into the future, you're out of your mind. You don't understand our current economic systems, no matter where you are, because this is the name of the game, right? Unless you're into the uh, making five hundred thousand dollars a year or two hundred thousand more than two hundred, you need to make you need to be making more than two hundred thousand dollars a year right now, in the United States, to have a, a hope in hell of, of building a large enough nest egg, right? To take care of family, may it be just you and your partner or yourself or you and children and elders or whatever, right? the way that you accumulate wealth right uh, to become financially ind independent you have to invest in things now it's up to you what you consider wealth to be right if you're you consider wealth to be your family your community uh food security and all this then you can go buy property in certain places and build a collective where you can have that right that's a great way to be if you consider wealth to be education health um, community family building something sustainable that is anti-fragile highly recommend it that'll last longer than any of the markets that you see right now taking place if your idea so you don't just make capital and money salary and sit sit back and say well someone will build it for me or i'll move somewhere that has that uh when the time is ready you know when i'm ready when i retire i'll move somewhere like that you're out of your mind right if you think building wealth is accumulating assets and you think you can do that just by your salary you're out of your mind right and so on and so forth okay it's like deciding that wealth for you is intelligence and you're going to wait until you retire so you can read all these books that you plan on reading and going to university and getting your phd you think your mind is going to be functional on that level that you can actually do that and you will have enough time to do that and you will be in good health to do that why wouldn't you constantly be doing that working towards that if that to you is wealth i can't tell you how many people have met elderly and their senior citizens right when they've turned to me because one of the other things that i recommend is having friends that span every decade right have friends that are much younger than you and have friends that are much older than you participate in com conversations that uh the people you're talking to are much younger than you multiple generations and much older than you that way you get a nice spectrum of where you might have come from and where you're headed right it gives you a nice nice view nice view once you do that your money right but i can't tell you how many people have i've talked to in senior citizens that they sit there they might some of them extremely multi-millionaires right extremely wealthy some of them not right but one commonality that i've seen with a lot of them is they turn to me and say i i wanted to do this i wish i did this i'm going to do this but they never get it done right they didn't they didn't do what they wanted to do throughout their existence and they thought they could do it when they retired because they built up a lot of capital stupid okay don't go down that route if there's something that you want to do in your retirement start doing it now so you build enough knowledge experience and if you get to be that old you can do it really well and if you don't get to be that old you get knocked out of the game early on then at least you've done you've experienced some of your life some of the pleasures in your life that you wanted to have during the time when you were alive okay let's let's clear that crap out let's clear that out okay guys uh that's really important 
because pe people are getting confused here a little bit some people do that's what i'm seeing with the, with this not you guys in general but when i talk with people oh, i'm i'm working you know this many hours a day and uh, this 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 i'm like oh man so sad so sad <laughs>